Alright, we're back. We're just going to release the fish now. We're just going to press the internet. We're going to steam for about 30 seconds now. I think he's ready to go. Back to his home. There. First fish of the day. Not bad. Cameron's already had one on. So, yeah, I think it's going to end up being an alright day. It's been an. Alright. Get back to you, forget this. My target is to catch a tench, by the way, because I've never caught one. That's my PB carp, about four or five pounds. Right, we'll get right, right Cameron's just caught a skimmer bream. This isn't a good sign. No. Big and eight bream. Still a nice fish. Right, anyway. Oh, Liam's float has gone under, but he's lost it. Anyway. Give a bream. I don't like. Oh, good yeah. A little skimmer bream. I don't like them. I don't know if you can see it. Can you see it? Can they see it, Liam? I don't know if you see that. Yeah, yeah. I'm just zoom in a minute. See it. It's, uh, not, it's not very big. Not very good size right. in my swim, but anyway. Anyway, right. See you when I get another fish. If we get another right. fish, even. I've had one bream. I've had one bream and a roach. And Liam's had that five pound carp that he had earlier. And I had a carp on early on when we first got here. I think it might have spooked a bit. Up so pulled. Yeah, my my up pulled when I had my carp on. Must have been about the same size as yours. Yeah, they do put up a fight today, don't they? Yeah. I've never fished it, so I'm uh, glad to I catch the fish here. Uh, yeah, so we're going to make a change from floating edge to we're going to put cage feeder on and see how that can go for about an hour to cast it out to middle. And only because we're not getting bites anymore. It's got a bit dead in edge, you just keep feeding margin up, see if we can get any fish back, see mm. if we can get any if you're not feeder. Right, we'll get back to you. And then we'll eat. run you through rigs. Yeah, we'll use. get back to you. If we're running through rigs, update or if we get a fish and like that. Right, right, see ya. Yeah. Right, so I'm going to show you my rig now and I'm going to show you my rod and reel as well I'm set up. Right, so I've got Shimano XH 3000 SRC reel with six pound mainline, and then I've got this rod that I got off eBay. I think it's 11 foot. Yeah, it was 20 quid. I got three spare tips with it and a rod tube. Good deal. Right, and now I'm just going to show you my rig. So I've got I like a ledger boom thing. It's like two inch. And then I've got my cage feeder uh, on the bottom of it. It's like a grip mesh cage feeder. I've got a shot to buffer that up to. And if you keep going down, I've got my swivel, which is a barrel swivel. And then I've got my hook link. It's a method feeder hook link. It's six pounds, so I've got six pounds all the way through with double sweet corn on it. Now I'm just going to show you Cameron's rig. Right, as we said, we're going on feeder. Liam's had like one cast, and we've been it was cast out about 20 minutes. I'm just going to show you my rig and the ground bait that I've made and we're using. Right, so, you can, uh, can, can you zoom in. When you're doing your ground bait, you don't want it sloppy at all. You want it just. Show them. Just to dry it up a bit, like that. But if you press a bit of pressure on it, it'll go down. You don't want it sloppy the fish at all. That's the main job of ground bait, just to attract the fish and get them like, munching around and not And that's another good thing is, when you're making your ground bait, add other things like pellets. bits of like small pellets, like 2 mil particles. pellets, particle baits, yeah. We've added pellets to ours, 2 millimetre pellets. So just a random grip so you can. Alright, so Cameron's just going to show you his rig. And the play of the ground bait today is Q21 mixed with a bit of white crumb. From uh, Kevin Ward's, our Kevin local angling supply. Alright, so Cameron's going to show you it, Rick. Uh. Well, my big that I'm using anyway, I've already shown you one. Similar though, near enough same. Alright, uh, I don't know if you see me then, it's coming out. Is my rod anyway? My rod is a they were match quiver, it's like got a match tip and a quiver tip. So, 
an old Daiwa God Dog. Got him as well. Yeah. And then I've got my normal Ultra Quick Real. Yep. I got Flames Granddad for it with loaded with six or eight pound line. Then down to the business end, I've got two pieces of corn. Two pieces of corn. Yep. You see that? Air rigged with a stop. And that's up to a size 12 car book. That's air rig. And then I've got a number 8 swivel that my that my up length is attached to me. Up length line is, I think it's eight pound. Uh, and that that's onto my main line. That that end that swivel. And I've got a number. What size shot is that way? I think it's like a number six. Six shot. Just so my feed come up. Feed come buff up to it. Then I've got like a feeder ledger boom thing here with a quick link and a small Drennan 12 gram small so bait feeder. It's a number four shot. Yeah, number four shot that shot by the way. And then that's just my small little cage feeder, 12 gram. So that's my rig. Just load it up with ground bait and cast it out. See if we get fish. Cameron, load it up with ground bait and then we'll see where he's casting it out. So this is Cameron's station. A station for the nation. Yeah, he's got like all his bait and stuff. That's his ground bait in that little tub there. What are you gonna put any sweet corn inside it or out, Cam? Not this cast. No. Not this cast. Just get a bit of bait out of there. Sign into it. We'll get in each end. Yeah. So it's nice and compact, but not too compact that it won't come. We're out. only going out feeder for a, an hour or so, aren't we, Cameron? Just to get. Uh, margin, margin swims, swims the rest. Yeah. Right. 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 Worth it. Yep. I've already had a drop back bite. And if your line ain't sinking, just real slow and never real quick because it'll move your feeder. You don't want your feeder to move. No, you don't. Right. Oh. Someone's just touched my tip of belt. Is it? Right. <coughs> we'll get back to you if we get a fish. And then you need to tighten up to it. <laughs> See if you get a fish. Right, so what I'm doing is I'm just going to show you the baits that you should be using when you're doing these type, type of fisheries. Right, so you just want your classic mixed maggots. Yeah. Uh, I've got some worms. Yeah, some nice worms. If you go to fisheries, they'll most likely have their own pellets. This fishery and so if they go into a fishery that's got its own pellets, definitely buy those pellets. The fish are used to eating them and used to the smell of them. I've also got sweet corn, bit of green giant there. Yes. And um, I've got some hookable pellets. Well, they're not hookable, but bandable. Big eight millers. And I've got some bread. And that's about it. Yeah. So you just want to be feeding constantly and steady. Not too much in winter though. Right, I've given it an hour. I've not caught anything. Cameron's sticking on it for some reason. And yeah, so I'm going to float and bring Cameron's peg because I've seen a good spot where Cameron's been baiting up. I'll get back to you if we get a fish. Fishing on the bottom on double maggot and keep catching these little roach. Right, I'll get back to you. Whoa, I'll get back to you if I get a bigger fish. Right, Cameron just looked into a big fish on Pelly close in. Right, I'm just gonna sort you out and I'm gonna net it for him. Right, I'll just put you down up.
That is way bigger. It's not, it's about the same kind of colour. Right up here. Right. In the net, lad. Bring him over to me. Right. I'm just going to knock him. I literally just plopped it inside and uh, I, I was just about to chuck some more pellets in and it took its shit on the bottom. No one at mirrors. I'll get you the scorch. There's only a few mirrors in here. So, it's a pleasure to catch. Yeah, come. Come on. I need a photo. Yeah, come. Okay. Of this, is that where I look that? Ninja. Fighting like a. He took its shit on the Just tell you. Have a look at it. Yeah. It's only a size 14. Just get it out now, Cam. Come here. I'm shaking like a bastard. So I'm just swerving. Oh, this one got like, like a mouth like a bum hole. This is a nice one. Yeah, but it's great where you can turn it out, yeah. Come on, get it out for you. You got low battery, Cameron, so we better hurry up. Cameron? Yeah. Leave it in the net. It needs support. Woo, 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 woo! Easy. It's strong. Where's your phone? In a pocket. I don't know. Oh, what, what pocket? In, what yeah, I'll open that. Get it. Get my phone. <laughs> <laughs> ah! Ah! <laughs> <laughs> uh, mate, look at his tail. It's alright, it's alright. Proper good fight. I mean, look at it, it's like curved in. Sorry, I haven't done it. It's broken, isn't it? Mm. That's match fishing, that. I don't think it's ever been caught before. Well, it obviously has if it's got a tail like that. No, it might have just been. Right here, Lee. Take a photo. Wait. Don't worry. Oh no. Just uh, calm him down. Oh god, don't worry. Hurry up, because we've got low battery cam. Right, just lift him up. Come on, stop tensing. Oh, I don't only want a photo. God, come on. Right, it's been a while since I've held a big fish, so... It's not even big. Well, a decent size fish. Oh, thanks. Cameron, just... Hold, just hold the fish, mine was too. Yeah, not as bad as that. It was. Oops, it's kicked. It's like Cameron. Hold him all. <laughs> this is going to be a profile picture, isn't it? Yeah. Better get some good ones. I'd say they're both about five pounds what we've caught today. You got me in it? No. Alright, let's release him then. In the net. Wait, whoa, whoa. Get the hook. 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 Fine exemplar. You can't right there, can't that's it. Just put him in the net. Let's see him go. Why going back now, geezer? Okay. Don't worry, no. A different peg copy. Put him in the net. Same peg. I did. Now we're going to go first off. Yeah. Ah. Hurry up, Cam. This were on a banded 8mm pellet, was it, Cam? Right, wait. Let's get some stuff. So I don't want to fall in, we can't. can't we? Well, I don't want to fall in at all. Well, it's alright to go. Come on, this way. Oh, and yeah, he's, he's gone to sulk. He's just down here. I couldn't hit him, actually. No, don't. He's gone there. Oh, he's gone there. Oh, mate, he's brung out the bottom up. Right, that's a fine example. I'm going to switch off now. Back up again, babe. Well, that's going to have to be it today, for today. Uh, it's been a good little day, hasn't it? Yeah, it has, yeah. Uh, we've, we've, had a, we've had a couple of fish. Yep. I've had a bream, a roach, and a carp, but I lost the carp early on. Yeah. Up pulled, and then straight, oh, af yeah. straight after that carp that I've just caught, 
that you've seen. Another one I had another one on and that come off. So right. not that bad. I've managed nine roach and a carp. I had my carp on early on. I had my float just started sailing into the middle of the lake. They don't spit carp in here, aren't they, Cal? No. There's, like there's a reason. There's a reason for they don't they don't let you use hemp. Oil like or uh, I, I pro I oily baits because it fattens carp and it went now nah, now nah, we realise why they don't don't let you do that because the fish are just fit fit us out and the gear make good fat even though they're only like five pounds don't they? Compared to all craft fish, a lot better fat. Yeah, and there's a lot more in here to be honest. But then there's bigger fish in here as well. There's like foot. It's, it's been known to thirty pounds has been took out of here. Well, there is thirty pounds in here. Yeah, so, so uh, we know it's only been like not a very long video, but we've been trying to catch as many fish as we can. It's so my first time fishing him and all, so it's Liam's first time fishing at clear water. We, we might have put a link to the video to the website. We ain't got a website. Well, we, it's a sort of website. Isn't it? <laughs> well, yeah. Right, so that'll that's be it. Do you mean, you mean? For Next time, where will we be? Here. Either here or or God is or some somewhere 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 to where do with this fish. Fish. Yeah. Mm. Bye. 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 Bye.